Hello everyone. In this session, I am going to discuss the important question from uh, module one. The title of module one is Pro Process of Design, Understanding Design Thinking. Okay, Basics of uh, Design Thinking, IDT. Uh, now we will discuss a few important questions from module one. It may be useful for your university examination. Kindly go through once. The first question is, innovation is defined as, could you please identify the answer? the commercialization of a new product or process that is called the innovation. Now, moving on to the another question, process innovation refers to, could you please identify the answer? The right answer is uh, implementation of a new or improved production method that is called process innovation. Now, moving on to another question, innovation can help to provide a temporary competitive advantage when? So, among four, four which is the right answer, the second one, that is, Barriers to uh, imitation are low and intellectual property rights are difficult to enforce. That, that is the appropriate answer. Moving on to another question. Following establishment of a dominant design in the product life cycle, what would you expect to happen? So please read all the options. From this option, we found that emphasis on process innovation rather than product innovation. That is the right answer among the four options. Moving further, established firms relative to new firms are better at. So, uh, for, what is the difference between the established firm and a new firm? Okay, so that is the difference. Now, what, what is the find, best reference you have to find out from the options? Innovation, which is competence enhancing. That would be the right answer. Outsourcing of innovation globally is more likely where? Which is the right answer? Innovations are obviously autonomous. So moving on to another question, what is the first step of design thinking process? Definitely empathize. Empathize is the uh, first step of the uh, design thinking process. After you empathize, what would be the next step? So definition, you have to define the particular problem. That is the next step. After empathize, you have to define. Uh, after you define the problem, what would be the next step? IDH. ID. After definition, you have to go for IDH. Then once the idea is done, you have to go for prototype. Once the prototype is done, uh, we have to go for testing. So likewise, you can expect similar kind of question. So but from this, I, I would like to add one more question. Uh, what would be the last step of uh, design thinking? Obviously, the last step of design thinking is testing. The first step is empathize. empathize. The last step is test, testing. One question is confirmed almost because they may definitely ask what is the first step. What is the last step of design thinking? Or else they may ask the sequence also. In the model question paper, we found that they are asking sequence. Fine. Similarly, what would uh, what would interview people gain to understanding of how they feel during the dash stage of design thinking? Obviously, empathy stage only. During which stage would you consult experts to learn more about the areas of concern and to gain understanding of people's experience? Obviously, uh, empathy stage only because this is the quite important stage, most important stage of uh, the design thinking. Uh, during uh, which stage would you gather the information about people's needs and motivation? That also empathize only. One question is confirmed based on this particular stage. Uh, when defining a problem, you know, uh, state the you problem statement uh, should include a solution. Is it true or false? Obviously. Uh, defining a problem means we don't know the solution, right? It's a false only. During which stage would you analyze the observation and data collected in order to identify the problem? Definitely problem definition stage. During which stage would you write a problem statement of focused specified need or goal? During the definition stage only. During which stage would you brainstorm the idea based on your observation? Ideate. Okay. At this particular stage, the, the brain the brainstorming idea should be evolved. During which stage would you create model of your solution? Definitely prototype. We have to, before implementing the real time, we should make the prototype. Once the prototype is done, you have to go for testing, uh, which is not a good interview strategy for the empathy step. Please read all the options. We found that encourage short answers that uh, get right to the point. So there is no like uh, answering, short answering. Okay, like examination is not like that. Fine. Uh, question, another question, uh, which uh, which is not an aspect of defined step of design thinking. Define as many possible solutions to the problem as possible. That is the uh, old man out from these four options. Which is not a guidelines 
for the idea step considering the practicality of each idea before sharing it that is the right answer which of the statement about the prototype step is true uh, the point is to get your idea out into the physical world real time world fine uh, which is not uh, true about the test step only consider the positive feedback to the best result it is not like that fine now we will be getting positive impact as well as negative impact so uh, the third option is uh, the old man out among the four that means which is not true fine no not true means the third one is correct which is not an aspect of the empathy step evaluate prioritize evidence of the support and choose on the problem that is the right answer so moving on to another question of first module which of these should be completed before you build something uh, please identify the right answer so do some research question number uh, another question what is the first thing you do when solving a problem? Definitely de de define the problem. In research channel, we will be going for problem definition. Okay, it's a first step. What is the second step of in uh, solving the problem? Preparation, obviously. Uh, what is the usual order of the problem solving process? Definition, preparation, uh, try, finally reflect. Fine. These are the sequence of problem solving process. Uh, preparing to solve the problem might include the brainstorming. Is it correct or not? Of course, it's true only. Uh, which step of the problem solving process is this? I am thinking of the pros and cons of my idea. It is basically preparation only. Once the problem is defined, you will be going for problem uh, preparation. Preparation of the particular. What is the uh, method to solve the problem? Preparation. Uh, if you are making a plan, uh, wh uh, what part of the problem solving process you work on it? Obviously, planning all those things are under preparation itself. Uh, if you are attempting to put your plan into action, what part of the problem solving process you work on it? Making a try after the preparation, going for a try. Design thinking is, can you please identify the right answer? Defining, framing, solving problems from user perspectives are belong to the term design thinking. Uh, what are the steps of design thinking process? This is one of the most important questions. Kindly uh, try to understand this. Empathize the problem, definition, ideate, prototype, testing. Once again, I will repeat, empathize, definition, ideate, prototype, and testing. First step is empathize, and the last step is testing. Most important question it may ask in the examination. Uh, design thinking is a linear process. It is absolutely false only. It's a purely non-linear process. A, co a college is regarding its websites. Current students are the main users of the website. Which one of the below elements should definitely be on the website? Information about courses, of course. Which of the below firm is associated in the most with design thinking? Definitely IDO. This is also one of the important questions you might have seen in the model question paper. Design thinking typically, typically helps in, obviously, innovation. Okay, innovating the new idea. Uh, one needs to have professional training in design to become a design thinker. Is it correct or not? It is the false only. There is no like the special course on design thinking. It is coming from naturally, right? Uh, which of the following well-known consulting firms are offering design thinking solution? So all the so all the companies are uh, following the design thinking solution. Uh, which of the below is incorrect? Uh, so read out uh, properly. Uh, so we can from this we can say that all the statement which is mentioned in the question that is uh, incorrect so these are the few important questions from the mo module one i request you every i request everyone to go through once again and kindly note on the most important point especially what is the first step of design thinking what is the last step of design thinking and the order sequence all the and uh, some true or false statements also i mentioned and also some of the institution those who developed a design thinking first IDO, like that is some kind of questions you have to note down very clearly. So uh, definitely you can easily uh, score good marks from the first module. So thank you for uh, listening this video. Let me come up with uh, uh, another video before your examination. Uh, thank you so much for watching this video. Happy learning.